Whoa there, King Nick. Huh? It's your turn to look after the princess. I want to fight the dragon. But I'm a king, and kings fight dragons. So do queens. <clears throat> Sounds like you're fighting each other. <gasps> it's the cat. The cat in the hat. At your service, my king and queen. <laughs> Royal Jibber Jam. Nick doesn't want to look after the baby princess while I fight a dragon. But, but, uh, but dragons breathe fire and fly. Uh, babies, uh, well, um, well, they sleep a lot. Ah, babies can be fun. In fact, they can be part of the adventure. Isn't that true, princess? Could you cut up your booty? My friend King Cecil the Seahorse takes all his babies wherever he goes. How? Would you like to go to Seagrass Meadow to find out? Yeah! But what about Princess Panda? She can come too. Your mother will not mind at all if you do. Mom, can we go to Seagrass Meadow to meet King Cecil the Seahorse? King Cecil the Seahorse? <laughs> okay. But be extra polite if you're meeting royalty. Okay. We can go! We can go! <laughs> They're dancing! Whenever seahorse mates say hello, they link their tails and do -si do Is that King Cecil? It is! And Queen Cerise! <laughs> they sure are having fun! Let's meet them, shall we? Seahorse size! Press the shrink -a doodle Nick! <laughs> Approaches King Cecil and Queen Cerise. It's me, the cat in the hat, and my friends Nick and Sally. Cat, so good to see you again. Greetings, Your Royal Highness. Welcome, one and all. Please come on in. The water is lovely. Yeah! yeah! Splish Splash, what brings you to our underwater kingdom? We want to go on one of your adventures. Will you be fighting dragons? Dragons? No! <laughs> I must boldly go and find a new home for the babies. Babies? I don't see any babies. That's because they haven't hatched yet. All the eggs are right here, inside the royal pouch. <laughs> it's true! I put them there! But can't Queen Cerise look after the eggs while we find a new home? That's my job. I'm the one with the pouch. Our eggs stay in there until they hatch. See, Nick? Babies can be part of the adventure. It's because of my babies I'm on an adventure. Cool. We want to help, too. Aw, oh, super idea. Good luck. Aren't you coming, Queen Cerise? Oh, no, no, no. I need to find food. We'll soon have many mouths to feed. Doodoo! <laughs> do 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 do! Hi ho! Let's go! Huh? Why are we going so slow? The seahorse is the slowest swimmer of the sea. His tiny fin can't go as fast as you or me. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Seagrass! Good! I like a place with lots of seagrass! <laughs> it's so soft and tickly. Perfect for babies. <laughs> oh! Hey! What's going on? Whoa! It's a current, a strong water flow. It sweeps you up and away you go. Better go back to find him. Let's go! King Cecil! Yoodles! Over here! How come you 
didn't get washed away? Good question. Now, look closely to find a good answer. Hmm. Oh, I know. It's because your tail is wrapped around the seagrass. Correct! The mighty king sure knows how to cling. Oh, quick! Grab onto some seagrass! Ooh! Gotcha! Uh. Phew! Maybe this isn't a good home after all. Indeed! This water moves too fast for baby seahorses. All clear! Let's go! Hmm, this place looks good. It's got lots of room for all your babies to play. With a little bit of seagrass. Yes, gentle water. Mm-hmm, yep, pretty good. Except for them! Take cover! On my way! <gasps> oh. Oh. oh no! Those fish will stack right into King Cecil! What do you do when your king is in trouble? Call Thing 1 and Thing 2. They'll be here in the double. <laughs> Why, thank you, Thing One and Thing Two. Phew. It's a nice place to visit. But you wouldn't want to live here. Uh-uh. It's way too busy. Hi. Ho! Let's go! Wow! <laughs> Wow, what a beautiful place! With lots of hiding spots for the babies. And soft seagrass. And rockabye waters to get them to sleep. We found the perfect home! <gasps> King Cecil, your pouch, it's moving! So it is! The babies have hatched! Make way, here they come! The babies are coming! Lovelies. Ooh. <laughs> Do you like our new home? Why, it's got everything our babies need. Yay! Oh, I love a happy ending. And I love taking care of the babies. Me too. Come on, grab the seagrass with your tail. You can do it. <laughs> Look, they did it! <laughs> well done. <laughs> How would you two like to become our royal babysitters? Anytime. But what about that dragon you want to fight? Taking care of the babies is way better than fighting a big old dragon. <laughs> ah, the seahorse dad is a dad like no other. He carries his kids like a kangaroo mother. In his tiny pouch, they stay till they're grown and ready to swim around on their own. <laughs> he searches the seas for a place to call home, one with food and shelter, and a safe place to roam. Ah. <laughs> Thanks for the big baby adventure, King Cecil. It was the best ever. My kingdom is always open to you. Goodbye, my friends. Goodbye, King Cecil. Panda cake, panda cake, baker's man. Okie dokie, then. Who's ready to fight the dragon? Sorry, Cat. We've got more important things to do. Like take care of our baby princess. Oh, she's so cute. Sally, Nick, snack time. Coming. That means you too, Princess Panda. Coochie coochie coo. <laughs> Say hi to the dragon for us, cat. <laughs> I will. Here, dragon, dragon, dragon. <laughs> Welcome to Hat Chat. Today we're talking to a pufferfish. Hi there. So, why are you calling?
salt a puffer fish. You don't look very puffy. Not yet. See, we're kind of slow swimmers. Awkward even. But we can gulp down a lot of water really fast. Um, and that's a good thing? Sure. If I'm about to be swallowed by something, then I just do this. Whoa! Can't swallow me now. Cool, huh? Impressive! Very cool! And that's why a pufferfish is called a pufferfish! <laughs> Thanks for the interview! My pleasure! Can we see you puff out again? Sure! <laughs> 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 